In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can easily connect your own domain with Stitchy. Right now, if you do not have your custom domain attached, then whenever you paste any kind of link to shorten it, what it offers is that it will offer Stitchy own domain. As you can see over here, you have hi.stitchy.io or swisui.co. So these are the two domains which Stitchy uh, recommends if you do not have a custom domain attached. For any kind of affiliate link, it is always welcome that you have your own custom domain attached with it. So for that, you need to go to the settings. Over there, you have the custom domain tab. Now what they have done is that they have very beautifully written the steps that you need to perform in order to do so. I will be showing you it practically. The hosting which I am using right now is that Hostinger, so I will show it for Hostinger. But the procedure is same for every other hosting provider. First, you need to log into your hosting provider. Now you must understand that you need the domain name and its DNS. So even if you do not have a hosting, it does not matter. You need to have a domain name. So I went inside my Hostinger account, and over there I am visiting the domain. I have two domains available with this particular platform i will be using the mindpedia.com domain which is my primary domain and over there you need to head over to the dns in the dns what you need to do is that you need to create a cname record so that is step number one you need to create a cname record and then link it to this particular stretchy domain so just copy it Please remember there is a dot after IO, so remember that. Head over to the domain, over there you can find other CNAME also. Just search for CNAME, type whatever you want to give it a name. For example, I want to type go, so my domain custom domain will be go.themindpedia.com and after that something else. If you want social, you can type social over here. If you want to type buy then you can type buy over here you can create as many cname as you want i am using go then i will be posting the link which uh, switchy has recommended so just copy that just remember that there is a dot after switchy.io and leave tll as it is once you are done just click add record you will see that this particular record has been added so let me search and see whether it has been added or not. See, it has been added. Now remember that the name which I gave was Go. So I will head over to Stretchy. I will go to the custom domain part. I will write go.themindpedia.com. In place of the Mindpedia, you will put your domain name. And in place of Go, you will put whatever name you have given. And then add. It should not take more than 5 minutes for the entire thing to work so your domain is ready right now my domain is ready one more thing by default what switch does is that suppose i shorten a link let me show it to you let me copy the link and try to shorten it now you will see that switch is going to provide me with my custom domain so other than the two domain which it provides I now have my own custom domain of go.themindpedia. I can write anything after that in order to make my shortened URL more brand friendly. Now by default, Stitchy, suppose the shortened link does not work, in that case it redirects it to its own website. So in place of that, I will be redirecting it to my particular website. You can redirect your shortened URL to any other if there is a 404 error so whenever there is a 404 error or the link does not work out uh, switch is going to redirect it to my particular website in place of this particular website what you can also do is that you can add the smart page link so in my coming videos i'm going to show you how you can create a smart page so you can add smart page also or you can post to some other place it doesn't matter you can just go over here and change it so this is how easy it is to add your own custom domain in stretchy i hope you find it useful 
the links are in the description you can buy